Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt. This is Coogan Cassis Rifle TV in association. Can you can use this mic as well. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. Sorry. <laughs> That's cool. One, That's right. This one. That's okay. fine. That's cool. Um, yeah, Coon Cash is here with <laughs> Cash Farouk. Now we've got the mic situation sorted. Uh, first of all, congratulations. What was uh, the assessment of your performance? Yeah, I'm happy with the performance. It's good to be back boxing again, especially this uh, pandemic that's going on. You know, I'm, I'm on the few. I'm on the few. I'm only a few of the fights that's getting out at the moment, and uh, I'm happy to be out just boxing. It has been a frustrating period for you so I suppose up until you literally walking into that ring uh, it must have played on your mind whether you were going to fight it would have done yeah I did because I've been <laughs> I've been through it right right up to Friday we didn't everything was done and obviously second my second man the cut well, obviously the guys who helps me out going well so he came in and he tested positive and that and that was it you know and so even Friday night I was worried just in case something did happen so you know I was like until I'm in the ring and he throws a first punch I throw a first punch then and then I say, I'm not worried. You know what I mean? Even, even I was walking the arena, I was like, I don't know. And then he didn't turn up. I was like, you know, anything can happen. Because obviously, but it wasn't going to it wasn't gonna happen. But I was just worried back your mind because you've been through everything. And it's my second time being here. So I'm I'm happy just to just to get out and box now. So hopefully this whole fight, cab uh, fight bubble situation is kind of now. You've got your win tonight. So it's kind of over with and it's ended on yeah. a positive as opposed to what you've kind of been through. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm really, really happy, you know, and, uh, you know, it's made the victory uh, sweeter. Obviously, I've had two co-ops, so couldn't they give me a point the um, 17th of October, and uh, the last fight, obviously, when I went, uh, went to the boy to my uh, corner, man tested positive, and, uh, you know, it's just, it's just been, you don't want to go back to the track, you don't want to back, get back to spawn, and just use your things, you know, and uh, it's just, it's just this has made it you know, more sweeter, and obviously, I've got tie on the line as well, and that's, that's an extra bonus for me. Um, just looking through social media, you probably haven't looked through it yet, but there's people obviously uh, watching tonight that's really kind of singing your praises, uh, moments of brilliance in the fight tonight yeah. from yourself. But um, yeah, what kind of score did you give yourself tonight for that performance? You know, I asked my trainer and obviously the cup man as well has helped me. What do you think? Uh, how do you rate it? You know, they said it was seven, up, seven or maybe eight or ten. So, you know, if obviously if my trainer's happy, then I'm happy, you know, and uh, I need to watch it back how, how I performed, so then I can obviously tell. But Overall, I think uh, maybe seven or eight. I was well, probably I would say. Obviously, the biggest voice <laughs> yeah, behind you is yeah. your promoter Eddie Hearn. And yeah. what did he say about your performance tonight? Yeah, he was happy. You know, <laughs> he's a guy. You've got a good IQ and uh, enjoy enjoyed the fight. And uh, he's a guy. We're gonna try again nice and early out next year. So I need that my uh, cut heal up. So and uh, then I can get back to the gym. You know, I'll, be, I'll still be running and punching the bags and that. But I'll give that a wee bit of rest and give myself a wee bit of rest. I've been in the June. I've been in the gym since June. I've just been training, training, training. I've not even, not been out, nothing. I mean, you see my friends, so I've just been in the gym, working hard. Cash, I know you're obviously sick of people mentioning uh, yeah. uh, Lee McGregor to you, but that fight for 2021 surely will happen. Yeah, 100%. You know, like I said, uh, when it happens, you know it happens. You know, I'm not too worried about it, but when it happens, I'm going to focus on it. But like I said, it's a fight everybody wants to see. And, you know, and uh, you know, like I said, I'm here, you know, I'm willing to box and so is he, to be honest. But he's got his European fight schedule up and, uh, you know, I hope, hope he does win because he'll make a bigger fight for us. And it, uh, financial wise, it'll make, make a lot of sense for both of us. So, you know, and uh, it sets both of us up for next year. And, uh, you know, I don't know when he's going to get reschedule his fights, but, you know, I hope he does win and we can definitely get it on. But at the moment, it's no, I might end up boxing someone else, but in my mind, whoever's next is next, you know. You leave that to your team, basically. Yeah, that's it's down to my team. You know, I don't, I don't really decide with it. If they say you're boxing him next, then that's him. You know, it's, it's not my job. All I got to do is train hard and spar, and uh, run. That's my job, and uh, you know, I'll just leave it to my manager and my trainer, and uh, the rest, the rest I'll do. Cash Farouk, thank you very much for talking to IFL TV. Is there anything else you'd like to add before we finish, mate? Yeah, I just want to thank my sponsors, especially you know, all my sponsors, my thing, you know, especially Porto Scudi. They've helped me fin uh, financial wise, and you know through a pandemic, you know, right through a pandemic as well, you know, especially my, you know, they, 
I got to thank them a lot, you know, especially Arnold Clark as well. They've helped me through, gave me a wheel call, you know, my strength conditioner, Alec Whelan at Pro Life, Sweet Science, you know, even Big Licks, you know, I'll be coming with them after this fight, so. And uh, especially obviously my trainer and my manager as well, you know, so thank, uh, thanks a lot to them, and uh, yeah. No problem, I'll let you get back to your dressing room. Thank you very much for talking to IFL TV, and uh, hope that heals quickly. Yeah, thanks so much. Thanks, thanks a lot, Colin. Yeah, cheers. Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO. Free, impartial advice on all your debt.